Hey, it's Nicole Steen. Today is a full body workout to tone every muscle. Let's get ready to work. All right, you guys ready to my full body workout? You ready to get started? Ooh, so yeah. Ready. Let's go ahead and stretch. Deep inhale, exhale. Yeah, stretching it out. We're gonna warm up this entire body. We're gonna tone it all up today. All right, take it down and up right here. Yeah, side to side. Good, feel that stretch. Give me a little half roll. All the way to your right. Other direction. Yes, you guys. Now open up those arms. Give me a nice plie squat. Good. So we're gonna work the whole body, the arms, the abs, the glutes, the legs. Everything's getting strong today. Toning it all up. We have Christelle over here. Hey. And then we have Casey for modification. Okay. All right, give me two more. Squeeze on the up, and one. Bring those feet to a mid stance, and one, take it side to side, right there. Yes, yeah, so mid stance squat, shooting those hips back, keeping your core engaged, warming up the legs. Yes, two, and one. Now hold it here, down and lift a knee. Down, lift, yes. Stretching it out, warming it up, Four more, three, two. Now we're turning these into hip openers. Yes. Stretching out the hip flexor, groin area, getting it loosened up. Three, two, and one. Let's go ahead, loosen up our torso, rotate it out. Yes. Stretch it right here in four, three, two big arm circles. Get into those shoulders, taking it back. Give me four, three, two. Now lunges side to side, hands on the floor, lateral lunge over to the right. Press it up and down. So our right, your left right here. Three, two, hold it up, nose to your knee, hamstring stretch, back to center, lunge it side to side. Hold it over to the side here, push it up and down. When you're lunging, make sure your knee does not pass that toe. Give me four more, three, two, and one, hold it up, hamstring stretch, nose to the knee, walk it back to center. Give me a little bounce right here. Slowly roll it up, stretch out your back, twist it over, other side. Good, roll it up. All right, I think we're ready, right? Yep. Yeah. You feel nice and warm, you feel stretch. Here we go. So we're gonna start with a lateral lunge to a front kick. So let's lunge it over to the left and give me a front kick right there. So on a lateral lunge, we're getting into our abductor area as well as our glutes. This whole side right here is working. We're pushing forward on that kick to get into the hamstrings on that push. Yes. Make sure you're breathing into it. You got it. Four more. For modifications, we'll ask Casey on that. You can just step it in and still get that work. Last one. Good job. Shake it out. Let's get into the other side. Here we go. Sit it back. Kick it. Yes. Good. Step nice and long. Think about stepping as long as your leg is. You don't want to undercut it because you really want to get into that glute muscle. That push off is gonna activate the bootay. We like that, right ladies? Oh, we love that. <laughs> Four more. Yes. Three, two, and one. Good. Shake it out here. More lunging for you. Let's open those legs out. 
nice and wide, toes facing out the diagonal, hands go behind your head, rotating lunge. So you're gonna rotate to your left, go down, and come back up and squeeze. If the rotation's too much for you, you could just stay like Casey and not do the rotation. Good. So, we're getting nice and low on that lunge. Knee to the floor, yes. Working it out, squeezing your glutes every time you come up. Working the legs, working the buns, working the body. And by having our hands up behind our head, you have to keep that core intact. And your arms are getting a little bit of work too. Good. Keep it moving. And let's hold it here to the side. Pulse it for 15 seconds. Get low. Yes, burn it out. We love it, we love it. Four, three, two, and one. Shake, shake, shake it. Yeah. <laughs> let's turn it to the other side. Ready? Let's go. Rotate and squeeze. So always focus on getting your legs parallel. You want your legs and your knees, your feet, to face the same direction. Yes. Right there. Eight more. Let's get it. Eight. Squeeze. Seven. Six. Abs tight, elbows up, chest up, good. Two more, hold it down, pulse it right here, pulsing, yes. Get a little lower, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and release. Shake it out, I have a little cardio burst for you. Yeah. I love a burpee. So let's get into it. Little one minute burpee section. Take it up, shoot it out, and back up. You can go at whatever speed you want. It's up to you. You can walk it out if needed. Add a push up, whatever works for you. But this is your cardio burst. Getting your arms, getting your chest, abs, leg. The burpee is a full body workout. And that's what we're doing here today. Keep it moving. Now, if you're feeling spicy, you wanna add a little more flavor, you can give me a tough jump. Right, Christelle? Yeah, yeah. you got it. <laughs> I love tough jumps. I love jumping, period. So much fun. Come on, two more. Last one. Good job, you guys. Woo. Heart rate's up, all yeah. the way up, right? Yeah. Don't worry, we're gonna bring it back down. Let's get into some grand plie movements right here. Arms out, bend those knees. We're gonna pulse it, yes. Nice and low, tuck those hips. Now we're in a wide stance. Wide stance, you activate the inner thighs as well as the glutes. Let's lift your left heel up, pulse it. Yes. Keep pulsing. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Other side. Really push into the toe. It activates the glute just a little bit more. Six, five, four, three. Both heels up now. Pulsing. If you're finding trouble balancing, put those heels back down. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now hold it here. Push it back, getting into the back of those glutes. Push, push, and your arms are working as they push back for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Down and up. So down, squeeze. Still working the legs, still working the glutes. Now we're getting our arms a little bit more involved and our calves. Yes, you guys, at any time, if you wanna add more to this full body workout, you can grab a pair of weights, that's fine. Do what is going to work for you and your body. Challenge yourself. Give me four more, three, but we are definitely feeling it without any type of weights. For sure. Full body workouts, 
using your own body weight, that's all you need. Last one. Great job. Shake it out. Let's get more into these legs, into these glutes. Curtsy lunge to a front kick right here. So you're gonna take the left knee back to a curtsy, a diagonal, and then kick right there, yes. Down, kick. Nice and slow, nice and controlled. If you're having balances here, do you wanna go a little lighter? You could just tap. Yes. Really burning out the glute muscle. And then when you do your roundhouse kick, ha! You are turning your knee forward. Yes. So you're getting into the top of your hip right there. Four more. Three. Two. Last one. Hold it back and pulse it right here. 15 seconds. Burn it out. Get a little lower, yeah. How low can you go? That's right. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and release. Oh, right there. Fired up, buns of steam, baby. All right, let's get to the other side. Here we go, remember, knee goes behind the front heel, then kick. Yes, front heel, kick. Exhale on the exertion too, yes. There you go. Good. Can you give me just seven more right here? Push through. Get up there, get low. Yes. Come on, three, two, one. Hold it back and pulse. Low. Yes, 15 seconds. Let's get it. Right here, lower, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we were in the curtsies, now we're stepping back. Giving me, in ballet we call this balance. But we're gonna take it up, you can stay here, and jump, we're gonna skate. Skate, cardio burst again. I love my cardio burst. Come on, one full minute here. You could stay up to make it a little easier. You could just tap or you can jump. Like you're jumping over a puddle. Don't wanna get your Louboutins wet. Let's get it. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go. Skate it, skate it out. Reach for the floor. Keep your abs engaged so nothing is hurting your back. Keep those knees bent. Keep moving. Keep burning for 10. Nine, yes. Eight, seven, six, five. Give me four, three, two, and one. Ooh. So fun, so fun. All right, we're gonna work our obliques and our thighs, arms as well. Bend your right leg, left arm up, lift and lower. Lift and lower. So you're lifting with your oblique muscle here. Yes, lift, lift, there you go. Six, five, four, three, two. Now hold and pulse, hold. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, get it, four, three, two, hold and release. All this side should have felt that burn, right? Yeah, it did. Okay, good. I hope you fell down home too. Let's try the other side, let's go. Lift, turn that knee forward. You have to think about the muscle that you want to work. So many times people say, I feel it in the leg I'm standing on. I'm not feeling in the one that's moving. Well, you have to center your body so the muscle you want to work, activate. You gotta fire them up, four more. Three, two, find that balance and pulse. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold and release. Ooh. Last little cardio drive right here. Squat jumps. Mid stance this time, because we want to shoot our hips back. You're gonna touch the floor, jump it up. Come on, I just need 30 seconds. You with me, girls? Yes. Let's get it. Woo. Full body. Abs are pulled in. Glutes push back, reaching for the sky. 
Sky's the limit. We got this. Heart rate up. Breathe. I need eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we are gonna grab our mats, take it to the floor. Let's start with some push-ups. Do it. Doesn't love a push-up. I'm not sure. I really don't. I'm not gonna lie, I don't care for them, but I know if I don't like it, that means I should do it. So we're doing push-ups and the downward dog toe taps. You're gonna have your hands directly underneath your shoulders. Take it down, take your hand to your right foot and tap. Yes, down and tap. So if this is too hard for you, you can always go on your knees. And then you see Casey, she's not giving a tap. She's pushing up to a downward dog. Yes. We're just gonna get it all the way up here. Get that chest to the floor. Push your hips up. And that downward dog. So you're getting a nice abdominal workout on that cart. Can you give me 10 more? I suppose. I suppose. <laughs> Just kidding, Maybe. absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely. And if you can't reach your toes, you can reach for your ankles. Yes. Six more. Five, exhale on the up. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Oh, you did it, you did Ooh. it. Get a little stretch. Push-ups are best friend, right? You crushed them, though. <laughs> Not really. We love to hate them. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna go into some Supermans. Working our lower back, so look down to the floor. Squeeze and lift your legs and your arms and release. Take it up and down. So a lot of times people have back pain and it's because they're not working on their back. Your back needs to be worked on just as much as your front. I always say whatever you do in the front, you gotta do in the back, right? Whatever you do for your abs, you have to do for your lower back. So that's what we're doing right here. Eight more, eight, seven, six, and squeeze those legs, squeeze the glutes, squeeze the back, four, three, Two. Now I want you to hold up this last one. Let's take a swim. Imagine you're in the ocean of Hawaii swimming with the sharks. Yeah, let's go, uh, you gotta swim a little faster <laughs> then. Swim a little faster. <laughs> Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold, and release. Great work. Push it back. Yes, child's pose for a little baby stretch. Flip it over, get more into these arms. Some tricep dips. So you're gonna have your hands facing forward, bend your knees, and we're going to just push up and down. Up and down. So you really wanna push all the way up high enough to feel a little burn in the back of those arms. Yes, if you have wrist issues, you can go a little lighter like what Casey's doing. Yes, give me two more. We're gonna add a challenge. Lift your left leg. Yes, take it up eight and down. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and let's switch. Here we go. Take it down, up eight, seven, six. Think about pushing away from the floor. Give me four more, three, Two, and one. Both feet down, last eight right here. Eight, seven, six, five. Get into those arms. Four, they should be burning. Are they, Ooh, ladies? Yes. Yep. Two, Eey. and one. You did it. Oh, yeah. Shake that out. Let's lie down on our back. We're gonna work these glutes. All right, bring those knees in. Push up for some glute bridges right here. Up and down. Eight. Seven, six. So the key for this move is to squeeze on the up. I like to imagine that my butt is rock hard every time I come up. Yes. Three, two. This also helps to tighten your lower back as well. 
Now let's lift our left leg to the ceiling right here. Take it up and down. If your leg gets tired like Casey, you could put it on your knee or to modify it. Four more. Three, two, let's hold it up there and pulse it. Pulse it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold and release. Other leg. Let's go down and up. Seven, six. Now, if you ever want to challenge for this glute bridge, you can always come up on your heel or your toe or even put a weight in your lap. Yes, let's hold it up, pulse it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold and release. Back to singles, eight, seven, six, Five, four, we're getting that whole posterior chain right now. Hold it up, open, open. Really push into your shoulders so you can get a little higher. Four, three, two, now squeeze those knees in. Squeeze, squeeze, make your knees touch. Getting a little inner thigh action here too. Come on, give me four, three, two, now hold those knees together. Eight, seven, push up higher. Six, five, four, three, Two, and release. I told you, full body, full body. Uh, bring those knees in, get a little shaky shake. And let's flip it over to our side. So we're gonna lie down to our side, working our obliques. Hands behind your head, you're looking at the ceiling, you're looking at your right hip, and take it up and down, up and down. So your legs are in a 90 degree angle. Think about your ribs coming down to your hip bone. That's how you want your out workout to go right now. Four more. Three, two. Now hold it up and pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Extend your right arm out to your feet. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Come up on your left forearm and bring it in, in, six, five, four, three. Now bring it in and out. Make your elbows and knees touch. Push up away from the floor, working that right oblique muscle. Four more. Think of your body like an accordion, coming in and out. Now can you give me V-ups, side V-ups right here. Keep those legs together, six, if it's too challenging, stay with the bent knees. Four, or you could do a one leg, like Casey, two, and one. Yes, you guys. Let's get into that other side. Turn those knees down. Here we go. Look at your hip. Take it up and down. So when you're doing abs, you wanna look straight up. Don't let the chin come down to the chest. Make sure you're not forcing your head with your hands. Give me two more. Hold it up and pulse it right here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Extend that left arm for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Come up to your right forearm, left knee, left elbow for six, five, four, three. Bring it in and out like this, in and out. In and out. Yes. Working that core, working those abs. Three, two, side B up right here. Reach and lean back. There you go. Yes. Four more. Three, two, and one. You did it. Good job. A little stretch right there. Way to work, you guys. All right, we are going to take it to a side plank. So take it to your left elbow, and I want you to come up right here. We're gonna do side plank dips. Take it down and up. So you're really getting into that oblique muscle as you push up higher. If you need to go a little easier, put your knee on the floor. Three, two, hold it up. Lift that top leg and hold for eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and release. Good. Other side. Let's get into it. Press it up right here. 
Yes, and dip down and up right there. Keeping those legs straight. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold it, top leg, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and release. Good job. We're gonna take it to our back. We're gonna do some V-ups. I just added that in. So, <laughs> although we did side, now we're gonna go straight. So if you wanna go a little easier, you could do one at a time. Me and Christelle, we're gonna do 10. Single, both legs up. Ready, go. All the way up, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Little extra special thing for you right there. All right, let's take it to a plank, you guys. We're coming to the end. We gotta finish strong. So go on a forearm plank, elbows and toes. We're gonna go ahead and take it front and back like that. Forward and back. Yes. Right there. Eight, seven, six, five, give me four, three, two, one. Hold it here, give me some knee taps. Knee taps. Yes. Give me eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now I want you to give me toe tap side to side, like this, side, side. Still getting those abs burning. I know we're up here for a while. Push away from the floor for eight, seven, six, Five, almost there, four, three, two, and one. Can we just hold this plank for 10? Nine, eight, seven, squeeze everything. Five, four, three, two, and one. Ooh. Yes. Did you get a nice full body workout, y'all? Well, you know I think we got every muscle, right? <laughs> Toned it all up. Let's push up to a cobra. Ah, oh, stretch out those abs you just worked. Take it back to a child's pose. Great work. Yes, let's take it up. All fours. Bring it up and out. Up and out. One more. Good, let's bring those feet together. Slowly roll it up. Yes. Get that full body stretch in. Deep inhale. <sighs> Exhale, you tilt it over to your left. Stretching out the side. Great work. Let's take it flat. And down, nose to the knee. Go ahead and take it down to a lunge. And put that knee, that back knee on the floor. I want you to stretch out the hip flexors. Yeah, so, okay. so good, right? Mm -hmm. Oh yes. Release, take it down, nose to the knee. And all the way up to the other side. Reaching to the opposite side of the room. Flat back. Take it down. Good, and down to a lunge. Take that knee to the floor. Arms up. Push into it. Quads, hip flexor, get that stretch. So necessary, bring it down. Press up, walk it to the center. Pull through those legs. Hands on the floor, bend the knees, and sway it side to side. Slowly roll it up. And go ahead, give me a little stretch to the side right here. Other side. Roll it all the way up. Give me a deep inhale. 
Exhale. Way to go, ladies. You just completed full body workout.